I'm Gloria Ferris, a member of Western Cuyahoga Audubon Society. I am an advocate of doing what we can to protect and preserve wildlife habitat. Since Earth Day is coming up April 22nd, I decided to reflect on Earth Day then and now. In 1970, I attended my first Earth Day on the campus of Bowling Green State University. It was a bright, sunny day with speeches on the commons, groups of students singing folk songs accompanied by guitars, tambourines, and sticks. I was using sidewalk chalk to draw flowers, peace signs, and if you are not part of the solution, you are part of the problem. A long-haired, bespectacled, skinny guy stopped to inform me that the phrase referred to nuclear proliferation proliferation and had nothing to do with the environment. I paused, thought to myself, how does nuclear proliferation not have an impact on the environment? Looked up at him, smiled, and continued drawing with chalk, dusted hands. We thought the world would change quickly and be a better place. Forty years later, I realized how we as humans are resistant to change. It took rivers burning, disastrous oil spills, the loss of acres and acres of rainforest, the deaths of millions of birds, the, dis in the extinction of many species, and much more for the world to tip and know that we can no longer afford to wait and see. All during those years, advocates, scientists, legislatures, and everyday people who have improved our air, water, and land struggled on, but we can no longer have the luxury of letting George do it. Action is needed. It is sad to know that today many children have a fear of nature. We as adults who played barefoot in meadows and streams, hiked through stands of woods, literally when stepping out our back doors, had a hard time recognizing the world of today's youth. Many of us recognize it. Many of us do not accept the impact of not knowing our interconnectedness to nature, and some of us are working to change it. Western Cuyahoga Audubon Society is working to change the disconnection of youth to nature by developing a junior member program. Join us for the April 22, 2021 Guardians of Nature Meetup when we will have an interactive presentation led by Gloria Ferris, remembering past Earth Days, chronicle events up to now, and map out a plan of action to begin nurturing our youth to become birders, naturalists, environmentalists, and advocates for the natural world we all need now and for our future. Please come and add your voice and talent to our endeavor.